Hey, what's up, you guys? Tally here, coming at you with another beer review. Day four of my No Hype Beer Week, where every day I'm reviewing and trying one of the beers that Kyle over at No Hype Beer Review sent me. Uh, this one is quite fitting uh, tonight because we are about to go see, <laughs> me and Gabriel are about to go see the new Star Wars. I know, finally, I'm late to the party, but we're going to go see it tonight. And so I'm drinking Galaxy Brewing Company's Andromeda IPA. Uh, makes a lot of sense to me tonight. Uh, so we're going to go see the new Star Wars movies. I haven't been... No spoilers. Yeah, I've been... I've I, seen I a lot, but I haven't looked at them. So this is just an IPA from Galaxy Brewing out of Binghamton, New York. 6.7%. Don't know anything about it. So let's get into it. A um, little bit hazy, but it's a little bit clear as well. So about half and half, I'd say. <laughs> uh, pretty fluffy... Um, off-white head. I poured it pretty aggressively, but whatever. That's the boring part. So let's get an aroma. You're getting hit with a good mixture of, of piney, dank hops, um, a good amount of bitterness, some sweet, uh, bready kind of malt, malt in there too to cut through that bitterness, and a lot of nice, bright, citrusy, tropical hops as well. So I think this is going to be a nice mix between that New England and American bitter style IPA. I can't smell anything, but I'll try. Oh, I can definitely smell that. Okay. Let me get another smell. <laughs> it smells like gin. Let's get a taste of Andromeda IPA by Galaxy Brewing Company out of Binghamton, New York. Thanks, Kyle. Cheers. Surprisingly less bitter than I, it smelled. It smelled very centennial, very earthy, uh, piney, bitter. Piney. None of that flavor. Well, a little bit, but not nearly as much as I thought. Surprisingly light and creamy in the mouthfeel. Like, very creamy. Um, and tons of, uh, like, bitter... Orange peel, tangerine peel, um, you're getting some of that, uh, I need holes or no? a little bit, um, you're getting a lot of orangey type, uh, citrus flavors in there, um, orange, a little bit like a lime, almost, like a lime bitterness, um, some tropical, light pineapple, nothing too sweet like mango, um, or any of those types of fruits. It's very uh, bright, citrusy, uh, without the bitterness. A little bit of bitterness, a little bit of earthiness, a little bit of pine. This is definitely leaning more um, towards the New England style. Um, but, yeah, it's definitely not, not as bitter as I thought it would be. Um, a lot of those bright, kind of citrusy, orange, pineapple notes with a little bit of earthy, uh, earthy piney bitterness to it. Pretty good. I told you it smelled like gin. Pine needles, man. Fine. All right, so given this one an overall grade, I think it's a very, uh, it's a pretty well-made IPA. Um, I don't honestly know where it fits in the style. It's not quite New England. It's not America. It's not West Coast. Maybe it's somewhere, a new one. Somewhere in the middle. I don't think it's breakthrough new, but it's very good. Uh, I'm going to give this one an 85. Solid B beer. Um, nothing too crazy, but very drinkable for 6.7. It's very drinkable um, and really enjoyable, I'd say. Perfect beer for uh, pre-gaming <laughs> for the new Star Wars movie. So, thank you guys for watching. Thank you, Gabriella, or Princess Leia, as I should say, for joining me in this review. <laughs> You're welcome. You um, guest star. <laughs> um, thanks for watching, guys. If you like this video, thumbs up. If you really like this video, subscribe to my channel to watch all my beer reviews and all my other videos. Uh, comment down below. What's your favorite brewery from New York? Not New York City, so like other half and those don't count. Outside of New York City, what's your favorite New York beer? A lot of rules. Let me, I know, let me know down <laughs> below. Thanks again, guys, for watching. And thanks again, Kyle, for sending this. I'll 
link his channel down below too. He's an awesome guy. I'll see you in the next video tomorrow. Later. Later. <laughs> Day